there is increasing competition for every gallon of water in today's world. With over 79 billion gallons used every day for agriculture irrigation, growers need to improve crop yields while using less water and energy. Growers can save water, energy, and reduce costs by auditing irrigation systems, following good agronomic practices, and now by using new, innovative irrigation chemistries. Irrigation chemistries come in two basic types, infiltration surfactants and hydration surfactants. Before we explain these chemistries any further, let's take a look at how soil and water interact. The interaction between water and soil depends on factors such as soil type, soil particle size, soil porosity, and organic matter. Pores in the soil provide for the natural passage and retention of water within the plant root zone. A soil's ability to retain water is related to particle size and organic matter. Soils with fine particle size, such as clay, have more pore space and greater water holding capacity. Coarse soils with larger particle size, such as sand, have less pore space so water readily moves through it. Water cannot infiltrate tight, dry, water repellent soils. It bridges cracks and crevices and often runs off. Infiltration surfactants treat water and reduce surface tension and runoff, allowing the water to move uniformly into and throughout the plant root zone. Infiltration surfactant molecules have less lipophilic anchor, which attaches to soil, and more hydrophilic head, which attaches to water. When water treated with an infiltration surfactant is applied to the soil, the lipophilic anchor attaches to the soil surface and pulls the droplets apart. This is called surface tension reduction. Surface tension reduction causes water to infiltrate cracks and crevices in the soil and to move throughout the plant root zone. As water treated with an infiltration surfactant moves more efficiently into the soil, runoff is reduced and nutrients and soil-applied pesticides become more uniform and effective. Hydration surfactants treat the soil and hold water where it's readily available to the plant in the root zone. They maintain water content over time and reduce plant stress. Hydration surfactants have more lipophilic anchor that attaches to organic matter and the waxing coatings on soil particles, and smaller hydrophilic head, which holds water available to the plant over time. The plant easily uses the water held by the hydration surfactant, preventing the plant from going into stress. When the water holding portion of the hydration surfactant molecule is depleted of water, it waits for rain or irrigation water to replenish its supply. Crops grown on soils treated with hydration surfactants experience less stress and optimize yields, while using less water and the energy required to pump it. At Precision Laboratories, we believe improved water management can change the world and are committed to doing our part through education and innovation. For more information on Precision Laboratory's new irrigation chemistries with infiltration surfactants, hydration surfactants, and combinations of both, contact us at 800-323-6280 or visit precisionlab.com. <laughs>